don't do this. If you're in a machine shop environment, you will know exactly what I'm talking about. You don't put an end mill inside of a Morris taper unless the end mill has a Morris taper on it. An unnamed student actually did this. He put a end mill inside of a Morris taper adapter and put it into the tailstock of a lathe and semi-successfully cut his workpiece. Okay, let's fix this mistake and take the end mill out of the adapter. Okay, so what we have here is someone decided to stick an end mill inside of a Morris taper adapter. Okay, so obviously you know that that's wrong and it shouldn't be done. And the problem is a drill drift won't fit. There's the end mill at the bottom. And you can see there's nothing we can get in. So if we try and use a, a drill drift like we would if this was a regular drill, nothing happens. So there is a trick to get stuff out like this. And it's sad that I know what the trick is but it involves ball bearings. So what you do is you take some ball bearings, you put ball bearings inside. You can use... <laughs> yeah, you gotta watch it for the ball bearings, they kind of go everywhere. And that's how you get that guy out of there. Okay, this is a bit very difficult to see, but you can see the ring all the way around that little spot right there, all the way around. That is actually the spot where this thing went in. So, unfortunately, it's slight, but this collar is still damaged. Okay, so how to actually use this properly. What this is, is sometimes when you go to, let's say you wanted to put this drill inside of a tailstock, okay? But you go to put it in and, the tail, and this taper is too small. So you use an adapter, okay? You line it up and you just slide it in and it locks in. Now this part here is the tang. That does not drive, that ejects. So when you take a drill drift, put it in, Give it a little tap, it ejects the drill. Well, now we all know not to do this, and that's a good thing. If you have any comments, please leave them in the comments section below, and I got a feeling I'm going to regret that one. Uh, if you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe. It's free, and it'll help me out. All you have to do is click on the icon on my face, and I'll do the rest. Thank you for watching the video, and if you want to see other great videos, check out my YouTube channel, Shop and Math. Have a good night.